Hey guys, I'm just starting to give you a update video for all my creations so far and uh, I'll do an in-depth tutorial on the fighters you've not seen like Balboa and um, well, Rocky Balboa. Now this is one of Bruce Lee there that I've not really worked on. I just wanted to see what his face looked like with a deep fake version of Bruce Lee. So ignore that one. But I've got a few new fighters I want you to have a look at. This is an updated version of Mr. Boyka. We've you know, seen this guy before, Mr. Don Fry. Now this is a brand new version of Kratos. I've really been working on this one. I mean, you want to see individual, you know, with these ones you've not seen before. I think I've done pretty well there. An in-depth tutorial on Kratos. Just ask for it, Kratos. Just ask for it, okay? And I'll bring it to you. You've seen Michael J. White, and you recently must have seen the uh, real version of Manny Pacquiao. Jason Statham, Captain Price, you have Mike Tyson, the later version. Jean-Claude Van Damme, now this is how he looks in his current state. Let me know in the comments what you think. If you want to see an in-depth, in I started then. <laughs> if you want to see an in-depth tutorial on making this version of Jean-Claude Van Damme, then let me know. You have to request it because when I'm not really that happy with my creation, you have to, you know, if you really like it and you want to make it yourself, then, you know, request a tutorial. I'm doing all these requests and I'm doing a lot of, you know, hard work in this, in all this cap creation and the new deep fake things that nobody else is doing. And cl nobody's clicking like so they either don't like it or you just don't think about it you know that's how youtubers survive that's how the channels grow get them out there you know in youtube land we have bob sap we have the uh michael venom page who's actually entering the ufc in march i believe so that i'll do a fight I think I forget the I forget the name of his opponent, but I know he's joining the UFC. So that's good news. I'm pretty pretty pleased with the way that one turned out. Chris Cyborg. We've got Hatfall Bjornsson. You've seen the calf family for him. We've got Isaac Frost. Now, if you want to see a detailed tutorial, I'm not so sure I've done that Isaac Frost to be honest. go through these fighters now this is where I left Donnie Yen now I have to say that Donnie Yen's face no chance I've tried every possible thing I can think of to try and recreate that man faithfully have a look at his face yeah it's more like Donnie not anyway plan to have for that character is to keep it the way it is but to deep fake the face and I'm waiting until this dumbass store actually starts selling some decent clobber to put on your fighter like a black kung fu suit so you can actually have Ip Man against Bruce Lee and that's what I'd love to that's what I'm waiting for that's why you've not seen a calf formula for this character plus the fact that I think he looks like crap <laughs> And you've seen Kevin Randleman, Chuck Norris, Chick Congo. If you want to see a tutorial on this guy, then let me know. Now, the thing is, all these things I'm saying, if you want to request the tutorial, uh, Jackie Chan, Tommy Fury. You want to you want to see a tutorial? Then request it. Put it in a list. You know, all of you who, who decide to comment on this video, just just ask me what you want to see. You know, in detail. Now this one, Jonathan Haggerty, 
brilliant Thai boxer from, from London. So look, close look at this dude. You want to see an in-depth tutorial on creating this dude, then let me know. Jake Paul, I would say that's my most, the best creation I've ever I've ever made. I've done that all myself from scratch. I've not copied nobody. You know, I'm really pl I'm proud from that point of view because uh, there's so many have done great Jake Paul calves, but I'm happy to have done that myself, you know, without any help from nobody. Because at first I was gonna, you know, just see all the different uh, versions of it. Jack Reacher. Have you ever seen the Reacher TV series? Jack Reacher, you want to see a detailed tutorial? I will show you. Just uh, put it in the comment section. We've got KSI, of course. You've all seen KSI. Now, here's Tyson Fury. This is my interpretation of Tyson Fury. Let me know what you think in the comments. You want to see Tyson Fury explained in detail? Nice, lovely calf formula for you. Then uh, let me know. Peter, the body styles are not more comprehensive, you know. But that's about the best one I find for Mr. Fury. We have Nick Fury from the Marvel Universe. I was going to do Samuel L. Jackson, so I thought, hang on a minute. The first picture that came that I looked for was, was him in this disguise. Nick Fury. I like the way that one's turned out. If you want a detailed tutorial on this one, I will bring it to you. One a lot of people have asked for, Mr. Rocky Balboa. I don't know. <laughs> You're with me. Yeah. He's got such sad looking eyes, hasn't he? The way they tilt downwards on the outsides. Let me know what you think in the comments. You want to see a detailed Rocky Balboa tutorial. Once again, I say it's an absolute ridiculous pity. <laughs> I mean, I'm saying that wrong. It's ridiculous how the store has got such limited available availability. You know, it's, it's crap. We have Global Ang. Doodly doop doop. Another message off from YouTube. What do you think of that one? That's Club Alang. That's my interpretation of that dude. I've got him in a great fight against um, Ivan Drago. I've not actually made um, Apollo Creed yet. I must break you. You have the one and only Ivan Drago. I like the view, when you press tattoos, it gives you that view. I've changed his hairstyle from the one you might have seen recently. I think it looks pretty decent. Ivan Drago. They're the only decent red shorts you can put on him. As I say, Bruce Lee, I've not even done anything with the face. But uh, I, I might work on that one, or I might not. Because it's not an easy one to do. It's like Donnie Yen, not easy. The last two. Without looking at his name, who's that?
That's my interpretation of Floyd Mayweather. I think I've done his eyes a bit close together there. I'm going to work on that one some more. Once I'm happy with it, I'll bring the calf formula out. There's so many I've made recently while I've been off work, while it's been Christmas. And last but not least is the True Geordie. I believe the guy's name's Brian, but I don't want to call him Brian. <laughs> He's the True Geordie, and I've got him in a fight against Tyson Fury. Now, a few of you might not realise what they had a bit of a beef, and um, Fury was very nasty to him in a podcast that, he, well, in an interview he did with him because he was quizzing him about fighting um, Derek Ch Chisora and you know Fury was very defensive and very insulting towards him and then uh, you can see there's a bit of, bit of needle there so I've got them fighting each other so let's have a look at the true Jordan I <laughs> think we've got his likeness pretty much there now he's got a big lion kind of tattoo on his arm there and I've just improvised on the the neck tattoo because I'm not so sure. I'm, I think it says either that I don't know Delilah or Dallas or something. I'm not so sure what it says, so I've just put beast there, you know, because he he's a, he does look a beast until he uh, <laughs> sits next to Eddie Hall and people like them. I saw that one, but across his chest he's a hairy hairy dude, but across his chest he's got. It looks to me, the only photograph I could find of him, he's got tattoos across his chest, but they're quite dark and concealed by a lot of hair. Plus he's got all the uh, tattoos on his on his other arm as well. The true Jordi. Okay guys, that's all my fighters so far. Um, is anyone any one specific fighter you want to see the one that comes out the most I'll do first you know because uh, I know you want to see true jo well about you about want to see true Jordy and um, Floyd Mayweather and Tyson Fury Nick Fury Rocky Balboa Apollo sorry um, Club of Lang and Ivan Drago. Let me know in the comments what you want to see and uh, thank you for watching. I just thought I'd give you an update on my creative processes, my uh, little fighter creation team, my little uh, roster that I've made for the game. Um, if this gets out um, after New Year, which it probably will do, I'd like to wish all my subscribers a very happy and successful New Year and best of health to everybody. I love you loads. Thank you for watching and supporting me. And it means a lot. I'm Pemby. And I'm out of here. Thank you for watching.